guys what's up welcome back to my channel Molly here and thank you for joining me in another weekly vlog so today is Monday and I'm going to get my COVID vaccine very soon I am so excited I'm actually really nervous more than excited I would say uh, I hope it all goes well I really really don't like needles so I'm definitely a little nervous and scared but I do feel blessed that I am able to get it and really grateful for that so definitely don't want to take that for granted so yeah um, I'm about to go get that done very soon and I'll take you guys along with me. Today has been a bit of a slow day. I'm honestly not feeling well. Super, super anxious because I should be getting my period soon again. Honestly, it feels like as soon as I'm done my period, I have like one-ish week of feeling okay and then I just go right back into feeling shitty again um, and it can be really, really exhausting. So yeah, um, I'm just going through that shitty period again. Uh, I've been feeling really sad and um, anxious all morning and I just, I don't know. I don't feel like doing anything today, so I've been taking it pretty easy. I did a little bit of work this morning, but then I took like a two hour long nap because I just, my mind would, would not stop racing and um, I just had so much anxiety and I needed to calm down and the way I cope with things, which I don't know if it's really good or not, but I tend to sleep a lot. Like my body gets so exhausted, it just shuts down. And my way of escaping is through naps. Like it's been like that since I was young. And it was something that I never realized that I did until I got much older because like when I was younger, everyone would always be like, oh, she's so lazy. She's so lazy. She's always sleeping. Like I'd always hear that from my parents, especially. And when I got older um, and I realized I had depression and PMDD and you know that I just I had a lot of mental health issues I realized why I sleep a lot so yeah I took like a two hour long nap today anyways I'm gonna head out now and go get my vaccine okay I'm waiting for my appointment um, no one else is here yet I guess but I just want to get this done with. Oh my god. Okay, I officially got my first dose of Pfizer. I'm uh, feeling good so far, but we'll see. Apparently, you don't start feeling effects until like later on in the day or the next day or something like that. So I'll keep you guys updated with how I feel. Um, I couldn't film anything while I was inside because they didn't allow any photography or anything like that. So unfortunately I couldn't take you guys with me in there, but, uh, yeah, it was a pretty quick process. Uh, I got my needle. It actually didn't hurt as bad as I thought it was going to. And, um, and then they made me wait for like 15 minutes or so. And then they checked me out and then I have my next, um, appointment booked for August 30th to get my second dose. So I'm excited. I really hope that the COVID case to start going down in Toronto and you know things get a lot more under control and that we can actually have a summer because I feel like Toronto um, has been under one of the longest lockdowns in the world and it is getting super exhausting like I feel just so out of it I feel so blah um I just feel like my mental health is really really deteriorating being in this like lockdown so I really hope with the vaccines kind of rolling out and um Ontario getting a lot more doses of vaccines and things like that a lot more people can va get vaccinated and we can get back to somewhat normal because this has been a long fucking year good morning my loves it is tuesday and i thought i would give a little bit of an update on my vaccine because i didn't um do that last night so my arm is super sore i did have a little bit of a like dry cough but it was like on and off throughout the day yesterday this morning my arm feels more sore than it did yesterday um but it's not like unbearable but it does feel like it's like super heavily bruised um but other than that, I'm doing pretty okay. I haven't felt any other symptoms yet. Uh, my mom said that she didn't feel symptoms until like a full day after. So we'll see if I start kind of feeling it a little bit later on. This morning has been pretty rough for me. I've been crying all morning, if you can't tell already. Um, I've been feeling super, super anxious uh, because my period is coming. I'm supposed to be getting it really soon and um my anxiety has like gotten the best of me today um i feel really really hopeless i just can't shake these thoughts that like everything in my life is going wrong and that i'm not doing good enough and that you know i'm i'm just not good enough and i'm not trying hard enough and that 
I'm not going to make it anywhere. Like, I just, I can't get those thoughts out of my head for some reason. I don't really know where it came from, but that's just how I felt when I woke up this morning. And it's been super overwhelming. I've already cried three times and it's only 11 o'clock right now. Snot keeps running out of my nose, so please excuse that. <laughs> but um, I'm trying to distract myself as much as I can. And trying to keep myself busy um so i don't think about those things but i don't know it's just really overwhelming i feel like i can't stop i feel i just want this day to be over and it hasn't even started yet all right we are going on a walk hi hi <laughs> um i've been feeling sad all day all i've been doing is crying you can't tell by how puffy my eyes are it's just been a really shitty day. Um, so we're going on a walk, hopefully, to make me feel better and get some fresh air and all that good stuff. But. Happy Wednesday, everyone. I am with Kavita. We are at Sugar Beach. It is absolutely beautiful here. We just need to like get out of the house and spend some time outside um, in nature. I guess this is kind of nature. Uh, definitely by the water though. So we brought ourselves a little picnic. Uh, we bought some food from Loblaws. And yeah, we're just gonna sit and eat in the sun and have a good night or a day. <laughs> exactly. Oh, it's so beautiful. It is so beautiful. Happy Thursday, everyone! I made dinner tonight. I made some salmon and asparagus, and we have some macaroni salad on the side. And Vicar said it was good, right, Vicar? It's delicious. I'm so proud of myself because um, last time I made salmon, I fucked it up. I put like way too much seasoning on it, and so it just like tasted grainy and gross. So I'm really happy I got it right this time. And also, Vicar got vaccinated today. How you feel? I haven't grown a third eye yet, so, <laughs> so we're doing good so far. Headed on our daily walk. Wow, look at look at my skin. Let's see your skin. It's golden hour. Golden hour. So beautiful. Um, so we're headed out on our daily walk. I got my period and I'm in so much pain right now. And I'm hoping getting in a little bit of a walk will help ease the pain, even though I don't want to walk right now, but apparently exercise is supposed to help with cramps. We'll see how true that is. But yeah, the weather is so beautiful. Finally feels like summer. And I hope we get to go downtown this weekend. Cause I just wanna be able to like walk around and explore and kind of sit by the water, right? Yes, sir. Happy Friday, everyone. Well, not so happy for me because I got my period today like full force. Um, it was like slowly coming out on Wednesday and Thursday, but now it's like the full thing and I just am hating my life today. Um, I was supposed to do so many things today and I canceled literally everything because I just like there were so many errands I was supposed to run and I just canceled it all. I was supposed to go get my tires changed because I still have winter tires on my car. So those are my summer tires in the back. And um, I was also supposed to get my oil changed and then like pick up some clothes to do like collab and all that stuff. And it just, none of it happened. I woke up this morning feeling so anxious. Like I just could not get out of bed. My heart was beating really, really fast. And um, I was just in so much pain too. So I woke up at 7.30 uh, cause I was like, I woke up with a headache and then I like brushed my teeth, whatever. And then I got back into bed and I tried to sleep again. I slept for maybe another hour then I woke up again and I tried to kind of like get along with my day, but it just like, I had no energy in me and just so much anxiety. So I went back to sleep again. I took two naps by the time it hit like one o'clock. And once I woke up at one o'clock, I was just like, honestly, this day is just not going anywhere. So I canceled everything. Uh, now I am feeling slightly better in terms of mood. I'm still in a lot of like pain with my period and just 
really uncomfortable. Um, but Vikra is not feeling too well because he got the vaccine. He's been getting like a slight fever and some chills and stuff like that. And so I was like, you know what, I'll go grab some Tylenol because we ran out of Tylenol. Uh, so I'm going to go grab that for him and then come back home. And then we're probably just going to chill out for the rest of the night. I did a little bit of work, but I really took today easy. Honestly, I took this whole week easy because it's just been a shit show of a week for me personally. Anyways, come with me to go get some medicine. survive this pandemic. You're so extra. Stop it. Seriously, I'm not. I'm gonna die. Vikra woke up from his nap and he's being so dramatic about how he feels right now. He said you're feeling better. I am feeling better. But I'm still dying. Anyways, we're going out to get food and then we are gonna go for a walk after. Um, you know, I should be the one dying. I'm losing blood I guess I just got injected with some stuff I got injected I with stuff and it. I'm losing blood so and yet you look like you're doing much better than I am it's because women are strong and <laughs> boys are dramatic drama and so much drama I never get sick and I never honestly I haven't, I haven't taken a, a flu shot in I don't know how long. My body is definitely not reacting too well. Drama. We got some pizza. Vicar got Subway. But look how good this pizza looks. Yum. And he also took a bite of my pizza already. Happy Saturday guys. So I am currently at my mechanics. I am getting my oil changed and I'm also getting my tires changed. I got them changed like way too late. Um, I should have got them changed like last month, but oh well. Uh, we haven't really been driving anywhere, going anywhere, so it's fine. So but yeah, I'm here super early. Uh, I got here by like 9.30 in the morning and I'm just waiting for that to be done and then I have a few more errands to run and then I'll be heading home after that. Okay, I finished running my errands this morning and then I went back home and I also put on orange eyeshadow because it matched my outfit and I picked up press-ons from Rhonda and put them on because my nails were ratchet and disgusting and I am obsessed with these summer nails. Look how cute. Uh, and now say hi. Hello looking, everyone. Looking cuties today. Thanks. Uh, now Vicar and I are going downtown. We're just gonna hang out downtown, grab some food, maybe walk around by the water and just, I don't know, chill out because there's nothing else to do. Everything's closed and the weather's pretty all right today. It's supposed to be raining a little, but it's looking pretty okay right now. So we're hoping that it just stays that way. Protests going on downtown, but I don't know just stop now um, because this protest is forever long and it is cutting through everywhere that we want to get to and so we're just at a standstill now like there's like cars behind us cars in front of us wrong day to come downtown we're finally on the move after fucking like 20 minutes man <laughs> that was awful Okay, we picked up some Taroni and now we're headed home. Look at this. Look at my little baby tiramisu. So cute. I'm so excited to eat this. Okay, that pasta was really good. And now I'm eating the tiramisu and this tiramisu is so good. Oh my God. I'm so happy. I haven't had tiramisu this good in so long. I'm so happy right now. 
Happy Sunday, everyone. So today, Vicar and I are headed out to go grocery shopping. We also need to return the Nespresso that we ended up buying. Um, well, we basically what happened was our Nespresso was broken on the side. Like, I don't know why it was like, like one of the panels was kind of coming out. So we had to return it and order a new one. Um, so we got a new one in and Vicar has been using it this week and he really, really likes it. Uh, so we just got to return the old one right now, which is what Vicar is doing. And then we are going to go grocery shopping. Um, and then I got to do some work and then hopefully we're going to go on a walk or something like that. Cause it's so nice outside. The weather is like 20 degrees and I don't know why the hell I'm wearing a jacket. Cause I'm like boiling cause it is really nice outside and I'm really sad that I have to do work. <laughs> Okay, I oiled my hair. It's so greasy. I'm gonna wash it tonight. Um, and Vicar and I are ending our Sunday night off with a walk. Say hi. Look at you. Look at your skin, so golden and beautiful. What's up? What's up? What's up? <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'm gonna end the vlog off here because we're not gonna be up to much after this. So I just wanna say thank you so much for joining me in another weekly vlog. And if you did enjoy this video, please do not forget to hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.